Believe it or not, once a car is powered on, a small electric current is always flowing through the metal of the entire vehicle body. The voltage is extremely low, so people cannot feel it at all. In simple terms, the whole car body can be viewed as the negative side of the battery, always carrying current in the background. Modern vehicles all use a negative ground design. This means the entire body acts as one shared negative path. When an electrical component needs to connect to the battery negative, it does not need a long wire running back to the battery. It can connect to a nearby point on the body instead. Current flows from the battery positive terminal through the device and then into the body. Since the battery negative terminal is also connected to the body, grounding to the body is the same as grounding to the battery. So why do manufacturers use negative ground? The first reason is that it greatly reduces wiring complexity. If the body were not used as the negative path, every electrical device would need its own return wire back to the battery. That would mean many more wires, making vehicle assembly more difficult and future repairs more complicated and time-consuming. The second reason is corrosion protection. Yes, negative grounding actually helps protect the car body from rust. Corrosion happens when metal contacts acidic substances and loses electrons, turning into metal ions. Because the battery negative terminal is connected to the body, extra free electrons are always available. These electrons help prevent the metal from losing electrons, slowing oxidation and corrosion. This process is known as cathodic protection. This is why cars that are driven often usually show much less rust, even after long exposure to sun, rain, and harsh weather. Vehicles that sit unused for long periods tend to rust much faster. The small current flowing through the body can also help remove electrochemical corrosion buildup on the surface, further reducing the chance of rust spreading over time. The third reason is convenience when adding electrical accessories. Since negative grounding is an international standard, aftermarket equipment is designed to work this way. When installing a new device, the negative wire can be attached to a clean metal bolt or mounting point near the equipment, making installation simple and reliable. Finally, negative grounding helps reduce radio and electrical interference. When current flows through devices and returns through the body, the electrical potential is lower. This produces less electromagnetic noise, reducing interference with radios and electronics. Early vehicles once used positive ground systems, but they were later replaced by the more practical and efficient negative ground design used today.